Hello everyone, happy Friday. Today is Freebie Friday. How is everyone? Today it's kind of chilly. I'm wearing my favorite hat. And as I was listening to my daily personal growth podcast, I'm listening to Mind Valley. Have you, do you guys know Mind Valley? I love it. I love Vishen Lakiani. And today he's discussing with, um, I believe the author of Buddha and the Badass, the Buddha and the Badass, about self-awareness, self-realization, self-love, everything that has to do with yourself, right? And so how important is this to me so much? As you know, as I've shared before, three years ago, I started on this beautiful, joyful journey towards the discovery of myself, okay? As to reveal why I am Wonder Woman, as to reveal the Wonder Woman within me, this is why I'm so passionate about this because I believe I am Wonder Woman. Ever since I was six years old in the picture of my profile up there, she's been very special to me. And so I am on a journey, on a joyful journey to the discovery is what is my superpower? And I have an inkling to what it is. But anyways, regarding Free Every Friday, okay? You just have to comment this live, okay? With the answer of who said it. The question that I put in the in the in the description of the video. Okay? So, um today I was listening to this podcast and he was sharing his childhood story of when he grew up in the states. He's from Sudan. And he was talking about an episode, right, that shaped his life. And um I have some similarities because also I was born in Peru and uh, grew up in the United States. But every summer, every summer, my parents would send us to South America to spend the summer with our grandparents, our heritage, our lineage, to get to know our language and our customs and traditions, right? So we wouldn't lose that. And um, Carl Jung once said, if you don't make the unconscious conscious, it will continue to influence your life and you will call it destiny. You'll call it destiny. And so your past does not define you. It does profoundly inform your present and of course your future, but it does not define your future. And this is so important to me to listen to this because I am on a path. I am on a path of discovering, right? Self-discovery, self-awareness. I think that's the part. Um, the other day on Clubhouse, in one of my favorite clubs, probably the my favorite club, um, the 9 a.m. club with Abraxas, we were asking, there's, it's just positive vibes, no agenda, right? They were asking, if you could t teach one subject in school, right, what would it be? And after listening to about 15 people before me share what they thought, was a subject that should be taught in school. I gave mine, which is self-awareness, self-love, but self-awareness, because each of them presented something that is obviously that they are working with, that they've discovered their talent zone, right? Their talent area. And this is their strength, as you want to call it. I remember this test, Gallup um, Strengths Finder test. I don't know if you've ever heard of that. And it allows you to discover what are your strengths, what are your weaknesses, and it's no longer true that you should try to always fix your weaknesses. You don't ignore them now, you have to be aware of them, but you should work from your strengths. So I have Blake Mallon to thank for this because he shared this with me a couple years ago. And so I invite you to reflect upon that. And if you want the link to the Mind Valley podcast, it's amazing. I'll put it in the comments, maybe. I love Vishen Lakyani. I love Mind Valley. I feed my brain. As you can see, my Prove It Every Day app. Every day we have a part that we dedicate to our how did we fuel our body today? How did we move? What did we eat? How did we fuel our brain? Like our thoughts, our growth. And I do so every day through reading and my podcast. Every day I have a different podcast that is in an area where I need to improve myself on. So wish you a happy weekend, happy freebie Friday, comment and you win free ketones. Easy as that. Bye.